It's hard to believe that we're already coming to the end of this wonderful school year. Last night, we congratulated all of our little pre-Kers because they had their graduation. We are excited to know that many of them will be coming over into the big school for kindergarten in the fall, and we look forward to continuing on the journey with them. I want to thank all of you yesterday for the, we had our free dress day in recognition of all the surveys that were filled out. I want to thank all of you for being a part of that. Throughout this next school year, we will be continuing on with the reaccreditation process. We'll be working through our new action plan, and next May, we will have a team that will come in from all different areas of the province. They will be coming in to look at the wonderful things that are happening within our schools. So we will keep you updated as we go through that, out that process. Tomorrow, we recognize our eighth grade graduates. We come to the end of this time with them and send them off into high school. We look forward to many wonderful events tonight and tomorrow with them. And just a little note, we will be live streaming it this year, so please feel free to join us for that. As we enter into these last few days of school, I know we all grow tired. We are all trying to hold on to that very last day as parents, as students. And so we want to keep in mind that we want to finish out this school year strong together as a school community. And one of the prayers that I heard recently that has helped me every day is to pray to God in the morning. I ask him to help me to always do his work. And my new prayer that I've added on is, Lord, if I am going to be an example today, please let it be a positive one. And so as we finish out these last days of school, we ask for God to please help us to set a positive example in our actions and in our words. I wish all of you a very blessed long weekend ahead, and we give prayers of thanksgiving for all who have given um, to, in service to our country, all who have given of their lives. God bless you for a great day today and a wonderful weekend ahead.